Hi, I'm Zach Lemberg from the City of St. Anthony Public Works Department, here to tell you about a new federal regulation from the Environmental Protection Agency. This new mandate protects our public health by reducing exposure to lead in drinking water, which can cause serious health issues. To comply, St. Anthony must compile an inventory of each water service line in our community to determine the pipe's composition and to see if it is lead, galvanized, non-lead, or an unknown material. We want to emphasize that the drinking water provided to St. Anthony residents does not contain lead. However, lead can enter drinking water from corrosion of pipes and home plumbing materials. Because the city must inventory all water service lines in St. Anthony, we need your help to meet this requirement by doing a quick inspection and submitting the information. Today, we will show you how to find your service line, how to determine your pipe material, and how to complete the inspection report. I'm Richard, I'm a city code official. I'm here in a typical basin in St. Anthony, and I'm gonna show you how to locate your home's service line and identify the pipe material. Your service line and water mirror are typically found on the lowest floor of your home, in the basement or in a crawl space, and most often on the front side of your home. You are looking for where the pipe comes into your house and connects to the water meter. The entry point may be through the floor or a lower wall. Once you've located the service line, next identify the pipe material used. There are several common materials, lead, galvanized, PVC, brass, and copper. To help you identify the material, you may need a magnet. One from your refrigerator would work just fine. First, put the magnet on the pipe between the wall and the water meter to see if it sticks to the pipe. Of the likely pipe materials, the magnet will only stick to the galvanized pipe. For the next step, grab a coin or a key and carefully scratch the pipe between the wall and the valve. A lead pipe will scratch easily and reveal a shiny silver color beneath. If your pipe reveals a shiny penny color when scratched, it's likely copper. If it shines but remains reddish brown in color, it's most likely brass. If the pipe is PVC plastic, the plastic will most likely be black, white, or blue. If the pipe has been painted, the coin may not scratch through the paint and a small piece of sandpaper may be needed to remove the paint. For additional help, our website includes a photo to help you identify the material. Once you've completed the magnet and scratch tests and have identified the material for your service line, you need to let us know. Please take a photo of the lower pipe in the floor to just above the meter. Your phone's camera will work great. If you use a scratch test, please include the scratch mark on your photo. This may require you to take a second photo. Next, visit our website, upload the photo and information, and submit the report, which will automatically be added to our inventory. We must complete the citywide inventory by July 2024. Starting soon, we may begin visiting homes that have not yet submitted a report. Knowing the various pipe materials that we have here in St. Anthony Village will help us form a plan to ensure that every resident has safe drinking water. Do you need help with the inspection and submitting the report? Our city staff can answer any questions you might have or arrange for an inspection. We hope this video has helped you and that you now feel equipped to complete your inspection. We appreciate the assistance of all of our residents to ensure that we comply with federal regulations. Thank you.